Do you use boring programming languages? Why does it have to be so enterprisey? Are static types weighing you down? How am I going to get promoted if my code doesn't compile? Do people recognize the stickers on your laptop? I'm so mainstream. Boy, do we have the product for you. Introducing... Closure! Closure is a list that runs on the JVM. Closure! Immutable persistent data structures everywhere. Closure! There's also a transpiler from Closure to JavaScript. Closure script! First class support for software transactional memory. Reps! Actually, nobody really uses reps. Adams! It's easy. It's easy! No, I think you mean simple. Simple! Just listen to some of our satisfied customers. When I choose my coffee, I need to make sure there aren't that many other people drinking it. The closure fits my lifestyle perfectly. Hipster driven development! With closure, I enjoy using Emacs. Emacs is now tolerable! So it's critically important when you're building software to take into account not only the benefits but also the trade-offs. And an important part of closure development is analyzing the problem and considering more than one choice. All benefits, no trade-offs! Everything makes so much more sense when you realize it's just data. It's just data. It's not code, it's data. No code, only data. It's better to have 100 functions operate on one data structure than have 10 functions operate on 10 data structures. So what are you waiting for? Become a Clojurian today. Some restrictions apply. See store for details. Side effects may include side effects.